Okay, so welcome back to Vector X Vexo Philippines for a quick tip video. And in this video, I'll show you on how to use the vector shape layer mask uh, by just clicking here the shape layer, and then we'll just create a ellipse or like that, and go to window properties. So usually, on um, vector shape layer mask is a vector, but when you add feather. Um, it's still a vector but it's not a pure vector itself uh, I mean when you import it to uh, Illustrator it it will not be a vector so it's vector within the Photoshop kasi ibang vector ng Photoshop sa uh, Illustrator okay so yan so as you can see when I'm adding feather yan so pwede kong adjust by just yeah and then let's duplicate it and go to window properties again and medyo lower natin yung feather so yeah parang gagawa tayo yung light strike effect and pwede rin tayo mag add ng another one oops sorry not that one this one yeah and also again window properties feather so there as you can see Pwede natin adjust. Na, wag mo mukha siyang ganyan. So, as you can see, this one, ang benefit niya is when you resize it, uh, it will just adjust yung kakablur. Not like, disable ko muna to. When you create a marquee, marquee eclipse, eh, eclipse, ellipse, di ba? So, like that. Control shift n create new layer alt backspace para mag fill so normal layer it's a rasterized layer and then going to filter blur gaussian blur or sorry filter blur and then motion blur so nagkakaroon siya ng ganong effect or yung kamukha ng effect ng feather is the filter blur gaussian blur and we can lower that okay so pag in okay nyo Para nagbago isip nyo, ah, hindi pala ganyan yung pagkaka-blur. I need to adjust it more. So, ang nangyayari, we'll go to blur again. Hindi nyo na pwede siyang ibalik doon sa original niya na look. As you can see, yun na yung original niya. So, that's the difference of vector shape, layer mask, and the normal layer, which is the rasterized version. Okay, so go back here. Ayan, yan. Duplicate ko lang. I can then, again, adjust this one. Control shift. Oops, sorry. Go open overlay. Yeah. So we can adjust this pa. And then. Yeah. So, pwede rin gawin. If you want to have that effect na parang yung pahaba or yung motion blur, you can just right click, convert to smart object, and then filter blur motion blur and there you will have that effect which is na adjust then depending on your on what you want uh, so motion blur yeah double click nyo once nyo nababalik nyo pare dun sa original nya from the state na convert to smart object nyo Okay, so that's the uh, purpose of using the uh, vector shape layer mask. So hopefully, you learned from a quick tip, and I'll be uploading more tips soon. Okay, so don't forget to like our fan page on Vector X Vexo Philippines, and that's all.